some good stuff. Let's check it out. One, One two. Wait, slow down a three. bit. Three. Where'd the other one go? This one. Yeah. Nice. What else? I found that little white one. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Wental trap. Nice, dude. I was Let looking go. for a bean, but I thought Let it was a see. bean at first. Wow. So you got three uh, beans and a wentil trap. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit broken on top, but that's awesome. And some nice. Sandala. Awesome. Mm -hmm. How about that? Do we have more? I like these. These are pretty nice. They're everywhere. That's a nice little hole, sweet. Oh yeah. You are. Sweet. That's the first rental trap of the day. Oh yeah. I think we need to sit places like. Oh. Yeah. Do you want it? No. <laughs> oh, this is a um, jingle shell. They find them in Florida all the time. I guarantee there's a ton of people watching from Florida. There's a pheasant near your toe. Look, red one. Yeah. That was oh, nice. Look at that little hole. I think we need to sit somewhere and. Look for a while. A good scallop. Is it? Yes. Wow. Look at that one. That's so nice. <laughs> Nearly took it away. I was looking at a cowrie somewhere here. Where was it? Can you guys spot it? There it is. Nice. Common one, but they're nice. They're everywhere here. What's that? Broken. First one of the day. Cool. Oh, what do you nice, think? Wow. You still take that. Awesome. <laughs> cool. First one of the day, a little broken spindle. Look at this giant pile here. Oh, wow. That's incredible. It's high tide right now. Wow, we've got a lot along here. Look at this. This is exciting. Let's find some shells. Let's take a look through these shells, eh? We've got a bunch of piles today. What do we got? A nice little uh, scallop, pectin sort of thing. Pretty sweet. Got a huge pile. Wonderful. Comment down below what you think the best find of the day will be. Just searching for micro shells today. This is exciting. Well, a bean carry. First bean of the day. Is that red coral? I think it is. Wow. Sweet. Um, mida or something? I can't remember. Look at that. No. No. Hey. <laughs> Oh man. Oh, here's something. Oh no, it's just broken piece. Look at that. That is awesome. Wow. So much stuff. <coughs> wow. It's all broken stuff back there. What do we see? What do we see, you guys? Cool, uh, worm shell. Yes, push it back up. That's really cool, actually. Got a, uh, what is it? A bubble shell here. Awesome. And a piece of a textile. Nice, might find one today. Is that it? Yeah. Blue cowrie. There's so much here. Piles and piles. Awesome. All fresh stuff as well. Little cowrie shell there. What is that? Tiny Humphreys. Oh no, a tiny broken grape. Come look, got a candy. Super nice. Wow. 
That one is very nice. Bunch of nice lines on it. And a Japanese scallop. Small one. Awesome. I wonder what the best shell is going to be. Got a nice limpet. This is a black carry. Imogen's doing some filming on her phone today. What carry is that? Just a common carry. I want to find some more carrier shells today. That's what I'm trying to find. The tide is still pretty high. It's actually just rising a little bit, but you can kind of see there's a ton of piles along there. So as soon as the tide starts to drop, we'll see more. Oh, wow, a cork. That's cool. <coughs> Never found one of those before. I found a cork. It's interesting. Big old textile piece. I'm gonna start collecting the pieces as well start a piece jar. I think that'd be cool. Let's get closer to it all. What are we gonna find? There's a Humphreys carry. It's lost all of its color unfortunately. Oh is that a carrier? Nope. Worm shell. Coming down to the bigger stuff here. Clam shell sort of thing. These are everywhere. I really don't usually take them. And I'll probably leave that for someone else. Got a cool bit of coral here though. There's just so much to go through right now. Carry teeth. See? No, oh, you're joking. I think I'll keep it though, it still sits really nicely. Sweet. This is the pile I was digging through today. Oh my goodness, look at all this. Check it out here. Another little textile piece. Probably too small. A uh, dog whelk here. I think that's what it's called. I always get confused with the uh, minis. Wow, that's a nice big limpet. Awesome. Loving the limpets lately. Let's check out this pile right where I see a little pheasant. Nice. Oh, it's bro oh no, it's not broken. It's just got sand on it. That's sweet though. I'd love to find a big carrier today, like my biggest one ever. Let's check it out here. Big limpet. Awesome. And they're already dry, so you know that it's uh, got its original color like that. That's a big one. Sweet. What's Imogen got? Broken. Oh no. Man, that would have been so nice. Dang it. Keep it though, that's awesome. Dang. Did you think it was whole at first? Oh man. Look at this little one. Oh, and an Arosa. No, they're all broken. Yeah. Sitting right at the front here. Oh my goodness, that's gonna hit me. Nope, that was close. I've sat somewhere here, and we're gonna take a really good look through it all. We've got a bean carry, of course. We've done so well on bean carries the last couple days. There's a tiny moon. That is getting close. Oh wow, an abalone. Awesome, a little bit broken, but I never find those. That's awesome. Is that a bean? I think it is. I found an abalone. Tiny. 
a bit broken. See? No. Oh my. Yeah, sit somewhere and um, take a look through it. You find much more. Oh, wow. A juvenile something. Cowrie of some sort. Tiny scallop. Oh, it's a chitin. Yeah, I don't collect those. They're nasty. Throw that back in. I'm pretty sure it's dead, but... Yeah, they're nasty. Look through the bushes as well. Things sometimes hide in them. Get stuck through it. You guys, some of the different shells. The shells that I wouldn't usually pick up. That are like everywhere here. Let's try find some. Super old grape. Very old. Let's try find some different things. What would it be? Uh, ones I usually wouldn't pick up would probably be things like this. These ones here, they're everywhere. And they're always shiny on the inside. They're nice. I don't know, there's just so many of them I don't usually bother picking them up. These ones, they're everywhere. I'll only pick these ones up if they have a really nice pattern on them. Which this one's pretty nice, actually. These ones, very common. Uh, here's another one. They're everywhere. Nice things here. We got DNA coral, which is pretty rare. Very nice. And we got a big old, uh, what is this? A turbo or a topper? I'm gonna say it's a topper, a turbo shell, I mean. Definitely. Two nice little finds there. Still just walking along these little areas, taking my time, seeing what shows up. I'm seeing lots of uh, red bits of coral. My jar is pretty much full. So I don't, uh, I might as well. If I don't take it, then it's just gonna get destroyed. So, my jar isn't full yet. So once it's full, like look at that, that was just like six seconds of collecting. What the heck, a Nerf dart. That is a first for me. That's pretty crazy. Some kid must be upset about losing that. I think I only grabbed the bigger pieces. Oop. A Nerf dart, that's so interesting. So odd. Looks like it's been in the sea for a while as well. Good to get that out. Oh, here's a pile that's just showed up. Got a blue cowrie. Nice. Anything in here? Still haven't found a carrier shell today, but I did find two yesterday, so my luck was probably spent on that. It's washed up. A ton shell, nice. That's sweet. Really nice condition as well. Usually they're missing the, like the tip of them. So that's cool. Let's see what you can find in here. Got a little limpet, a bit broken. Got a bean carry hidden there. Wheat. Found so many beans today. What else do we got? Tiny uh, brown sand dollar. Cool. What else can we find? Wow, look at that limpet. Red. That's pretty neat. <laughs> a bit different. Ah, uh, that's a shame. That would have been really nice. Oh, DNA coral, second piece today, nice.
what do we see? Let's stop here. Carry shell. Cool. There's so much of this stuff. All the like sea bush and sea sponge. Is that a slipper shell? Sure is. I really like slipper shells. I think they're cool. I think they're unique. Let's stop here. Broken moon snail. Another nice limpet. It's a day for limpets. Honestly, we've found 20 or 30 today. Show you this one. How about this little pile? Not too much. All right, let's keep moving. Uh, limpet right there. Wow. That is definitely the biggest one I've seen today. Maybe even one of the biggest I've ever found. That's awesome. So many limpets today and they all have such unique colors. I think they're incredible. Wait for the water to come. Tough to see through it. My uh, shell jar has taken a fall. Oh, it looks like I've lost some, but there's no water that's been here. I must have like walked over it. Oh man, I hope it's all still in there. Like that Wendell trap that Emmy found. Oh no. Oh yeah, thank goodness, there it is. Thank goodness best find of the day and Immy found it so she would have been devastated what else did we find there's a bean sorry Mr. Krabs maybe he took it maybe it was Mr. Krabs all along a couple of cowries I think that was it cool that one. Guys, that is the end of today's episode of micro shelling. There was an enormous pile of micro shells today. It just didn't stop. Uh, we found some pretty cool stuff. Imogen found the best find of the day. This tiny Wendell trap. Super awesome. Been pretty lucky with those recently. Got a really nice clandestine. A bunch of uh, bean cowries all over the place couple of big ones some really nice scallops as well including that one it is a bit broken though got a couple ones there and a bunch of giant limpets here really nice ones bunch of uh, blue cowries pretty nice ton shell here found that at the end a couple of textile pieces broken grape unfortunately spindle piece and a bit of coral here and there Alright guys, thank you for watching, subscribe.